I think that people naturally, if they're donating money to something like Club 1872, will want to know how that money is being looked after, that it's being spent wisely, that it's being spent in the way that they would like to see that their money is being spent, and that they're being informed a little bit about how that's taking place. If that's to work, there has to be something that represents their interests, that they can trust, that they can believe in, that they can invest in. And for me, I think that can be Club 1872. Um, but it really does become an issue then for all of us as fans to think about the potential, think about our wish to become involved more than we are today, to want to give our money in a small way, because a lot of us giving money in a small way is what this is all about, adding up to a very large amount of money which will be a very real source of funding to the football club, is for all of us to decide where we sit on that. But it's for us now at Club 1872 as a board of directors to challenge you fairly and squarely as to what you would like to do and to, to appeal to you on the basis that we're committed as a board to looking after your investment, to reporting to you and to acting in your best interests at all time. But I think together we can be strong. And for me personally, I think that can be a contribution towards seeing my football club returning to the very highest uh, levels of performance in Scottish football, winning trophies uh, and being rightly regarded as, as the top club in Scotland.